Okay, so we've got some moving footage on video layer one. We've got a still image on video layer two. What we're going to do now is create a title and add it to video layer three. I want the title to appear okay. around about now on the playhead. So this is my little playhead. I can click, hold and drag okay. and scrub that. So now at this point in time, I want the title to appear. To make the title work, I go up to the top here where it says title, go to new title and default still is kind of like a standard to work with. And I'm just going to click, I'll give it a name, I'll call it John's title and click OK. And this is the window, oh poor John, he's got his eyes closed at that point, but we won't worry too much about that. Uh, if I want to work with the title uh, panel here, I've got a whole range of different types of titles of, of fonts I can work with there, uh, which they look really good. Uh, I'm just going to choose one. I'm going to get my little text box and notice that these tools are very similar to Photoshop or InDesign or Illustrator. You can just generally logically choose what tool you, you, you um, would like to work with. I'm just going to click, hold and drag the title and then I call it John Barry, that's his name. And if I'm happy with that, that's good. I'm not particularly happy with the uh, height of it. So I'm just going to bring that up. I might even change that font totally. I'm going to select everything that's there and we'll choose a totally different title. Let's choose this one here. Now I want to make that a bit bigger. So I can just go to this tool and just make that a bit bigger. Now you'll notice if I grab my little selection tool, I can then move it into the position that I want it to appear. And if I'm not happy, let's say I've got it up here and you can't see it because the shadow is not uh, strong enough. And by the way, you can adjust the shadows with this tool here. This gives you so many different options, so many different ways of controlling your, your, your text within your title. Uh, but one cool thing is if I want to put a background in there, I can go to these tools here and grab say, this particular background and, and drag across. Uh, maybe change the color to something a bit darker. Where's my color? There it is. Now I'll just choose, here's so I've got a darker color. And if I bring that up, notice it's hiding it. So if I grab my text and do a right click on it and go to arrange bring to front, then my text is in front of that and I can just fine tune that a little bit by just making this a little bit smaller. And you get the idea. So that's basically how you can work with titles, position them anywhere you like. Now it's important that you then close the title panel and it creates a little icon down here, uh, which is what you called it. I called it John's title. Now if I drag that into, or I haven't got my BGs and titles folders, I'm gonna cr create one now. I'm going to go right click and this time it's a new bin. I'm going to call it BGs and titles. And drag that up to there. So now I know where it's organized. Now it works like any other asset. What I can do now is just drag that title into uh, just next to the playhead and you can see it appears up there. If I'm still not happy with the positioning, I can then rework it anywhere I want it to go but I know it will appear so most of you at that point in time because that's where the playhead was. So that's how you insert titles and manipulate titles within Premiere Pro.